so I recently had the opportunity to um, have a look at the test version of the Herbie Hancock Masterclass. Um, and yeah, I just thought it would be cool to share how that experience was for those of you who are interested in the Herbie Hancock Masterclass, for those of you who have already enrolled, or for those of you who are just kind of curious about Masterclass in general. Um, I'm going to talk about three things. Um, firstly, I'm going to talk about um, what it is you get. Um, secondly, who do I think is the target market? So like, who is it for? Who's going to get the most out of it? And also, um, is it worth the asking price? Um, so what you get is 25 lessons. Those lessons go through things like music theory, uh, jazz theory, uh, piano technique, composition, and um, how the music industry works. And also I think a big part of it is just um, Herbie like kind of passing on his philosophy and why he creates music. And in, in a way, like there's, there's a, a big aspect of kind of kind of focusing on self-development, self-improvement as a musician, but also like as a person. The, my initial reaction was that the lessons were a bit short, but kind of as I continued to go through them, I felt they were kind of around the right time. I feel like Herbie likes to make a point and then not like labor on that point and, and like make things drag out. Um, so I think it's designed to be kind of punchy and just give you kind of all the essential ideas. Um, I thought what was great was that they, uh, when he's playing music, they give you the uh, sheet music uh, using a program called Sound Slice. So you can actually kind of play along with what he's playing or you can take ideas and just directly put them into practice. And I think uh, what these lessons are designed for is that you can really, um, you can really uh, watch them in conjunction with your regular practice, um, which I think is kind of an advantage over going to like a, a city hall to, to hear some lecture is that you can kind of play as you are learning. I think a big part of the masterclass is Herbie sharing the philosophy that goes behind his music and goes behind his playing and things like that. And I feel like um, in terms of that, like that philosophy can be applied to quite a broad range of things. So I think in that sense, I feel like there is kind of something there for everyone. Um, but I do feel that the people who are going to get the most out of it are naturally the piano players. Um, and I'd say like, if you're already playing piano at a basic level and you want to kind of extend your playing into jazz, then I'd say that this is like a really good starting point uh, because he gives you like a general overview of everything that playing jazz will entail. And um, I think like a huge part of the course is that he emphasizes you to find your own creative voice. And um, so I think because of that, he doesn't kind of like force like, oh, this is how, this is how you make jazz. This is how you make good music. I think there's a huge emphasis on like, okay, here, here's an idea, here's another idea. And you take the ideas that you're interested in and you explore those and you figure out yourself how to incorporate them into your own playing and into your own music. Um, I think if you already have like a lot of experience in playing jazz music, then you know there's a lot of things here that just won't be new to you. Um, but I think regardless of your level, it's really interesting to see how he talks about the creative process that went behind some of his famous pieces like Watermelon Man or like Actual Proof. Um, and so do, I do think there is value um, for regardless of what level you're at in terms of your music playing ability or your understanding of music. Um, but I would definitely say that it is more geared towards the beginner. I feel like you definitely, definitely get your money's worth. Um, naturally, some people are going to get more out of it than other people. Um, but I think in terms of just the content you get and the high production value, I think it is kind of worth the asking price. Um, I'd say that it's really important to realize that this is not like the be all and end all of learning jazz. I feel like, you know, this is like a small part of your kind of overall, of the, of the overall process of learning to be a good musician. And I feel like, you know, 
sometimes people can just look at like, oh master class like oh this is this is going to give me everything i need and it's like it's a 90 dollar thing that you can watch in a weekend and you will get a lot out of it but it is part of a much larger process and um, so i'm going to leave it there that's it for now um, but if you do have any questions any queries about the course then uh, shoot me a line in the comments and i'll get back to you as soon as i can and um, i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching